the mulatto, the mammy, uh, the buck, and and those stereotypes are all for the first time introduced in this film, and uh, and it it is uh, a legacy that that you know was introduced in this film and, and still kind of we struggle with it today. I mean, the thing the thing that you have to remember about Birth of a Nation is it was the Star Wars of that time. So so people saw this film and they were totally 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 blown away. From and so the images it, that it created, I mean, this is the, really the first epic film. So the images that this film created just seared in the minds of, of Americans. I mean, before this film, the Klan had, had pretty much died. Uh, you know, the Klan started right after the Civil War. Forrest, Nathan, Nathan Bedford Forrest, Forrest Gump, you know, he was the creator of the Klan. And after, uh, after the uh, Reconstruction and uh, the, the turn of the century, uh, the Klan had started to wane. And this film brought the Klan back. You know, when, when Griffith would, would uh, show this film around the country, uh, he, brought, he had Klan members in regalia outside the theaters. Uh, this was very, this is like, you know, guys in Star Wars stuff outside the theater. And people saw this as, as normality. And so that's, that's the thing that, it's, and it's, it's not about the great filmmaking. Of course it's great filmmaking, but that's not why we talk about this film today. We talk about this film today because when you see this film, you see all the things that really kind of uh, created the second Civil War, which was the Civil Rights Movement. This film shows us why we had the second Civil War, the Civil Rights Movement. And you know what? I, what I just show, I showed this film in my class at KU, and and this last time I showed it, uh, I said, "Now you need to go see the film Selma." So when you see the film Selma, you understand why black people didn't have the right to vote in the South, because this film uh, basically encouraged the South to continue its way of life and to deny black people their basic civil rights.